Hey everyone, Jonathan Allen here once again from Camp RV in Trafford, Ontario. Uh, today's walkthrough video, we got a 2023 Palomino Backpack HS8801. Uh, this one here is a nine foot hard wall truck camper made by Palomino RV. Uh, it fits a six and a half or an eight foot box, recommended for a heavy duty truck. It does weigh about 2,500 pounds dry weight, uh, but we're gonna take a nice walk around. We'll show you all the uh, nice features on the outside and then we'll check out the interior as well. Uh, so this one was ordered in the gray fiberglass exterior. It is available in white as well. Uh, we tend to order them both ways, but the gray really looks nice on a lot of different colored trucks today. Uh, we do have the roof ladder for accessing the roof for cleaning and servicing. Uh, it does come with remote controlled power jacks. We order all of our units. I should say most of our units that way. Uh, so they're the happy jack remote control. You can control them individually or all together. Uh, we order them with the uh, power awnings. So we have a power awning on the back. We also have a power awning on the side. Uh, the power running on the side has built-in LED lights in it, uh, so it can brighten up if you're sitting underneath on the on the one side. And there is outdoor speakers here as well. Uh, and with this awning, it does come out a bit further, and there are arms that can go back to the camper as well. Uh, the reason that the awning comes down and looks low is just because it typically you're sitting on the truck, so it sits a little bit higher. Uh, we do have our propane uh, compartment over on this side, so you got two 20-pound tanks, and they do have the gauges on them, tell you how full they are. Uh, we do have uh, all of the Palominos do come with the frameless windows, so they have a nice dark tint to them and cosmetically they're a really nice looking window. Um, uh, you got a window up at the, the bed area as well and we'll show you that bed area from the, uh, once we get inside. Uh, now one thing the Palomino does uh, that nobody else does, uh, they have a one piece fiberglass cap and then coated with Linex. So it's the same spray and bed liner that you'd put in the bed of your truck. And it just prevents stone chips when you're traveling down the road. And again, that's all a one piece cap. So it goes from here all the way to the top. And it does have the built-in automotive windshield on it as well. And you can see the contoured uh, LED marker lights up there. On the front here, we do have our plug. Uh, so when you put it on the truck, the plug uh, for the truck plugs in here, runs underneath and then plugs into the wiring at the back of the truck. Also here we have a battery charging station so you can charge up your battery. You've got a battery disconnect switch here. Uh, and then the bumpers on the front are the bumpers that'll bump up to the front of the box on the truck. Uh, so over on this side we have our power hookup. So it's a 30 amp marine style detachable connection. Uh, we got our freshwater holding tank fill here as well as a city water connection. Uh, we do have our tie down points. So there's four, two on each side, one at, two at the front, two at the back. And that's what uh, ties it down to the truck once you put it on. Uh, we do our cable and satellite hookups over here. We've got outdoor power outlets here. We've got our furnace vent here. And we've also got an outside shower over here. So hot and cold tap with a shower head that'll pull out. Nice feature on the Palominos. They do come standard with a tankless on-demand water heater system. Down here, we do have our sewer hookup. So the, the sewer connection is there as well as your drain valves. Uh, this is not enclosed because again, this can go on a six and a half or an eight foot box. Uh, now they do offer a, what they call a short bed package. Whereas if you order it with a short bed package, the storage compartment on the passenger side would be enclosed to allow for storage outside. Uh, we do have diamond plating up the back here to prevent stone chips as well. And in the box down here, we do have our set of stairs. There are collapsible set of stairs that'll scissor out. So when it's on the truck, you can set it, the stairs right underneath the door and walk up and down. And we also have a uh, sewer hose holder. So this gets bolted on underneath. Uh, we don't install them unless the people want them because not everybody does. Uh, we do have a nice LED light beside the porch here as well. And it is pre-wired for a backup camera on this model. Uh, now also on this model we do have a 100 watt roof mounted solar panel and it does have the built-in charge controller so if you are camping without a hydro hookup you can keep your battery charged up uh, just by being off grid. Uh, but come on in we'll show you everything else. So first of all our nice living area here uh, we do have the sofa which will jackknife down into an extra bed. The table does spin to make it easier getting in and out of the sofa area. Uh, we do have overhead cabinets above that sofa so good storage. Uh, and then also our control panel here for our awnings and then also the tank monitor, the water pump, the water heater, everything's all centrally located there. Uh, all the windows do have the pleated, uh, pardon me, the roll down shades and they're a slow rise so you can just let them go and they'll rise right up. Uh, we have nice little cup holders on both sides of the sofa and they even give you some USB ports beside the sofa here. Uh, full size queen bed up over top of the cab. There is storage on both sides of the bed. 
Uh, so you do have storage cabinets on both sides. You've got USB and power outlets on both sides of the bed, as well as little reading lights on both sides of the bed. You can see good storage inside those cabinets. They are fairly deep. And then we do have an extra cabinet right at the base of the bed here, as well as a drawer for storage. Uh, this one also has the roof vent up above the bed with the built-in max air fan. That's a three-speed 10-blade fan. Uh, we ordered this one with the optional TV, so that TV will pull out an angle if you want it to. So you can watch it while you're sitting at the dinette. And then down below here, it's got the stereo, which is AM, FM, CD, DVD, and Bluetooth. So you can put a movie in here and it'll play on your TV. Uh, nice big sink in the kitchen, and it does have the roll-up sink cover. So when you're not using the sink, you got extra counter space to work with. But otherwise, nice big sink. It's got a sharp looking faucet with it. You have your uh, uh, furnace thermostat on the wall here. Uh, we do have a three burner stove with the, the cover. So that'll fold down over top of it. You can see you got a nice backsplash behind the stove, stove top there as well. Uh, we got the built-in oven down below. And a good amount of storage. This here would be a uh, pantry. But it's also got removable shelving, so you can uh, take that out and then hang clothes in there as well. Uh, air conditioning is mounted on the roof, and the controls are right on it. Uh, I did mention we've got a solar panel. We've got our charge controller for the solar panel right here. And then also over here, we've got our control for the tankless on-demand water heater. Uh, fridge is in the back corner here. And that has fridge with a freezer and that this model here is propane and electric. Uh, we got another roof vent at the back here with a built-in 12 volt fan. And then the bathroom on this model has a nice sliding door. When you open that up, you have a step up to get into the bathroom, which you can see you have a nice LED light on. Uh, but then you do have your toilet shower all together. So it's a foot flush toilet. You do get a vanity. There's a medicine cabinet in there. Uh, and then cool feature, they've changed the lights in here. So you've got a built-in 12-volt uh, fan, and then the light's built right into that. There is also a skylight in that bathroom to give you some natural light. So again, this model here is the 2023 Palomino Backpack HS8801. Again, about 2,500 pounds, made for a heavy-duty truck, 6.5 or 8-foot box. We have this model in stock. Uh, give us a call today to book your appointment, and happy camping.